Hello Agents, in this video we're going to have a look at the King of the Skill Trophy or achievement if you're playing on Xbox and PC and what it requires you to do is just equip and use each skill in the game. Now uh, just a warning if you're a veteran agent or you are well informed on the game, this video ain't for you, you're going you're gonna to simply know um, how to get this. This is more for uh, newbies to the game, people that are learning it, a bit of a big Beginners sort of video um, so yeah this is for you guys now if you do find this video helpful at all please do hit like and if you want to check out more content my description has a lot of links it's got a link to our community a link to more content a uh, link to more about us really and if you do like us please do also hit that subscribe button now uh, I haven't got this trophy yet I'm just going through now for initiation of some videos and I thought do I even do a video because of how obvious it is? But again, I think it's best to cover all angles for people that might be unsure and new to the game. So when you start the game, you're going to be introduced to how the skills work and how you unlock them at this quartermaster here, who is at the White House. And you're going to unlock your first skill. Now, what you want to do is get in a position where all four skills are unlocked. Um, it might even be the position where all like extra skills are unlocked too. But at this point, I'm assuming it's not. Like, if you go into a skill, you'll notice that there's four different versions of this one. And, like, I've got three out of four unlocked. So I can't actually use that fourth one because I still need to get Shade Tech to unlock it. Now, that's going to be a problem to this video if it doesn't pop at the end and I won't upload it. Uh, but I'm hoping that isn't the case and you just need to use one of each skill as the, as the, as the trophy suggests um, so we've got to, we've got to test that fairy now what you're going to want to do from starting the game is basically go through it and you're going to want to collect as much shade tech as possible so that shd tech at the bottom that i've got one off in the bottom right um, it's easy enough to collect you will collect it through some missions alone but then when you look on your map you will see shade tech locations highlighted by the phoenix so i've got two that i can go and collect there there's loads of some in every area these are the two areas that i haven't really touched but if i go to other areas you notice they've all been cleared because i've gone round and i've got them now just doing that alone and going through the game natural progress will give you enough shade tech to eventually unlock every single skill so work on getting all eight unlocked once you have you should be able to get this trophy we're going to go and find that out now so you need to get out of a safe zone, you need to come out into the open world where you can aim guns and stuff. Uh, once you've done that, you want to make sure your skills are equipped. To do that, you go to character, Yeah, you go down to the bottom here where it says skills, and you equip two skills of your choice. Now, I've been running the turret and the drone, so I'm not going to practice with them because I've used them a lot. I know I've used the turret and the drone. So let's switch it to the pulse. Um, select any one that you want I'm assuming you just need to use one and select its location and then the same again um, oh sorry back up select another skill so I'm going to select the hive and any one you want again and put it in the other location so there's two skills selected and um, we're now just we just got to use them simple enough so uh, come out of the menu press to use press to use both skills have now been used and that should be tracked for the trophy now if you want to just do this quickly hold l1 and r1 to what you just um placed them on to destroy them and there you go the countdowns are going i can't actually equip another skill now until those countdowns are finished okay so now the skills have called down i'm able to go in and change them to two others i haven't used so we've done pulse turret hive we're going to throw the chem launcher on Again, any, I don't think it matters right now. And then I'm going to throw the Firefly on. And put it there. And we're just going to use these two skills. Now they've called down, we're going to go back in and change them again. Uh, so we've gone through the Chem Launcher and Firefly. It's now Seeker Mine, Drone. And shield. Now I know I've used the drone, as we said earlier. I'm not testing the sort in the drone, but you will need to do them if you've not used them. We're going to throw a seeker mine on, and then we're also going to throw the shield on. And now, once I've used both of these, I should get the trophy. Okay. 
and there you go king of the skull guys <laughs> that was a lot of furry in that i was guessing but it did work so you do only need to unlock each of the skills you do not have to unlock every variation once you've used the skills once you'll get the trophy it is easy as that guys if this video has helped again please do hit that like button and again please check out that video description for the link to our community a link to more content and hit subscribe if you like what we do thank you again for watching this and until the next video peace out